some tough love for you all today. Five reasons to stop making excuses and book the trip. Showcase suggestions. Where I share travel tips and lists of five to help make traveling with kids a little easier. As the owner of a travel agency, I hear all the time, I would love to travel more, but my kids are too young. Or I would love to travel more, but it's not the right time. Or I'd love to travel more, but we can't really afford it right now. But let me tell you, waiting makes it worse. That's number one. Um, don't, don't wait until your kids are old enough. The sooner you start traveling with your kids, the sooner they become better travelers. Plus, you think they're busy now? Wait until you have to coordinate the schedules of high schoolers and college students. I traveled a ton with my, my parents as a kid. And my brother, who's 10 years younger than me, didn't travel at all because by the time I was 10 and I have two other brothers, we had baseball and dance and Model UN and all this stuff. And so it just became so hard to travel as a family. So I got all of the benefits of traveling. Um, it instilled a wanderlust in me and a cultural curiosity um, that my brother didn't get because we, my, it was just, it was hard. It was hard. Um, number two, it's a great learning experience. World schooling was added to the dictionary um, in recent years. I don't know which one exactly, but I remember the article coming out. In addition to history, geography, and geology, kids also learn life skills and, like I mentioned before, cultural curiosity. There are so many benefits to traveling with young kids that I can't cover in this five minute video. So check out this video I did on traveling um, with young kids and the benefits that they can develop. Travel makes you richer. It is the only thing that you can spend money on that will make you richer. Experiences bond you together as a family and make memories that will um, keep your family together longer. There's been so many studies on this um, and you know, just do a Google search <laughs> on some and get some of these studies about how traveling as a family creates a tighter bond and creates this long-term relationship. If you're not sure where you want to go, well, check out my guide, 18 Summer. There's 18 destinations for traveling as a family, and it's by age. So if you're worried about traveling when you're young, when your kids are younger, the first four are really good for toddlers and preschoolers, then grade schoolers, and so forth. I'll tell you how to get that at the end of the video. Um, another reason to stop making excuses and book the trip right now is because supply is not meeting the travel demand. So many people have been cooped up for so long. They are ready to travel. So there's not going to be any travel deals for the foreseeable future. So don't wait to the last minute right now. In fact, so many places have very limited availability through fall of 2022. So I would highly recommend if you're thinking about traveling this year to book it now, especially for festive season and fall. Those are really booking up. Summer still has some availability um, and we're starting to book into 2023. Number five, life is unexpected. We don't know when another global pandemic is going to hit. We should take advantage when we can because we don't know if we'll have another opportunity for those bucket list trips. Is something going to happen to Venice? Is something going to happen in a country you are hoping to, to, to go to? Um, so take the trip now. You will thank me when you do. Um, and don't forget to get that 18 Summers Guide. You can get it in the link in the description right below. Thank you so much for joining me. I cannot wait to help you plan a vacation that you don't have to worry about. And don't forget to take a break from the busy. Need help planning your next family vacation? Visit us at showcasetheworld.com to request a quote or schedule a free vacation consultation. Want more great travel tips? You'll find those there too.